The family would like me to express to you um, their thanks. Their, um, I mean, I'm just looking at the crowd of people here tonight. And the fact that you've taken time out and, and come here to honor your friend, your classmate, um, uh, your acquaintance, or uh, if you're just here because you want to show support, we thank you for coming out. We will do a variety of things um, to honor James over the course of the next year. Coach Erickson and I met today and talked a little bit about some things that uh, we'll do during the football season. We'll, we'll kind of let you know about those things as we go along, uh, but we'll find a way to honor uh, James. Uh, Carly had written James a letter, um, and she asked me to read it for her, so hopefully I can uh, <laughs> do that without crying. My boyfriend James, I wrote this letter to you, so you better be listening. I know you are, but pay close attention. I want to tell you thank you. Thank you for loving me and being the best boyfriend I can ever ask for. Thank you for staying by my side your thick and thin. Thank you for being my very first true love. My favorite memory about him is going to be uh, how he'd come to my house and run to the fridge. <laughs> <laughs> He's such a little guy. And when he'd eat, wouldn't even chew his food, he'd just probably inhale it, <laughs> swallow it. He was such a funny kid. His laugh, he'd be gasping for air. He wasn't just a friend to me, he was a, a brother, best friend, family. And I always remember him and I love him. We don't, we don't number our own days. And we don't know, you know, what, what our future holds. So I, the thing I keep hearing from, from you is we need to make the most of the moments that we have. And so I would encourage you to, to take that challenge a little bit and, uh, and make the most of every moment. It's easy to get caught up in drama and stuff that, that, that takes away from who you can be as a person. And, and I think James maybe taught us a lesson that you live every moment for uh, the, the absolute maximum you can get out of it, whether it's playing video games all night until you pass out, or raiding everybody's refrigerator, or having 39 best friends, whatever it is. Um, he's, he's set an example for us and set the bar pretty high. So I encourage you to, to, to use his memory to motivate yourself. And uh, his memory won't, won't go away. Uh, we want to remember James, and we want to we want to make him smile from time to time. We love you, James.